Okay, so the the biggest surprises to me. Um. Okay, like I I I think De Bruyne like being a ninety one is kind of criminal, still. I mean, I, I don't know how that matches up to the other guys up here, but, like, for me, that was, like, really questionable. Like, I think... I, I, I even had, like, Man United fans commenting on my YouTube video today saying, like, what the fuck is good with that, dude? Like, you know, De Bruyne is... Uh, you know, that that's questionable. Um, I, I really think Van Dyke should be a 91, and I really think Ramos should be a... I'm gonna say, I, like, I, I think Ramos, after this last year, should be a 91 as well, but at least a 90. Um... This is a little annoying that he's still in 89. Ramos just had one of his best seasons, I think, like, in his career. Whatever, would anybody disagree with that? Ramos just had an insane year, man. Um, so that was a little questionable. You know, I'm not going to get into that whole VVD Ramos thing. We know how that goes. But, um, yeah, that, that was a little annoying. Uh, he scored a shit ton of goals. You know, ha Hazard is a minus three is tough. What do you guys think is fine? What do you guys think is warranted for Hazard? Like, I think maybe a minus two. Minus three is a is is, is a lot, guys. Like, you know, that's a big ass downgrade, dude. I think minus two is maybe fair. You know, he was kind of settling in. I don't know if minus three is really appropriate there, but maybe it's fair. Um, what else in here do I have a problem with? Like, I'm not gonna bitch about Conte because this Conte card is still, like, chat. This Conte card is still gonna be insane. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I, I understand that maybe some people are like, yo, that's fucking annoying, but his card is still crazy. Like, it doesn't really matter. Just gonna say that. Like, this card is still cracked, bro. He's medium high with these stats, bro. So, like, you know, I don't know. Dude, also, like, Koulibaly got a downgrade, but he got better. Did anybody see that, bro? Like, I'm pretty sure Koulibaly's card is better. Like, this guy got a downgrade, but his card is better. That's why I don't understand EA. Look at this, bro. 71 pace, 89 defending, 87 physical. Dude, he got a dribbling agility balance upgrade, four pace, same defending, one less physical, and he got downgraded. Like, this card is better. So, I, I that one I don't understand. Um, I thought this was a little harsh, man. I don't know what you guys, I, I don't know what you guys think. I think Mudger's down to an 87 is a little harsh, man. I don't know. Well, his rating this year was what, a 90? Or an 89? 90, dude. Like, minus three, really. I think maybe 88, dude. Like, I know he didn't have, like, his crazy year, but... Guys, like, minus threes are, like... I don't know. That's a lot, dude. I Like, he was still solid, bro. He wasn't the best, but, like, minus one or two, maybe? I don't know, dude. So, that was a little bit weird. Um, dude, all right. Let me talk about this real quick, right? These two guys. So, I these two I have very big problems with right here, okay? I have large issues with these two. Okay. Okay. Churi Mobley, guys, last year had 36 goals and 9 assists in 37 matches. Okay. I personally believe that he is still underrated. Okay. I still think this card is underrated as a player. He's very fucking clinical. And Aubameyang, dude. Bro, I don't like Arsenal, but this is ridiculous. This guy, bro, he had so did he just make the, the best 11 in the Prem or some shit? Like, what are what's going on here, EA? Dude, I don't know what's happening with this one, dude. Like, did he get stats upgraded? Because, like, dude, he got a minus one or a minus two, right? Bro, I don't understand, man. I mean, yeah, he kind of got a stats upgrade, dude. So what the fuck is good with these ratings, man? He got 93 pace. Wait, no, he lost pace. He got a shooting. I mean, dude, that's why, like, reading into it is not worth it. But, dude, I don't really understand. All right, Bruno Fernandez, obviously, like, that's probably deserved. As much as you guys want to banter Bruno a bit about the pens, um, that's probably deserved. I don't know. What do you guys think about Bruno? Obami has been disrespected. Same with Thiago. Dude, Obami had a really good year, man. I agree with that. Opinion on Sancho. We'll talk about that in a second, bro. Thanks for the bits. Johnson with the tier three. Johnson, I, ha I got you tier three emotes, bro. You got, you got to put them in the chat for me, dude. Juet, thanks for the resub. Jesse, EU, let's go, boys. Don't worry about it, free. Don't worry about it. I love you. Johnson, do it. All right, Bruno is good, but when people compare him to De Bruyne, it gets stupid. Nick Copa as well. Haven't been in, the, in a while to catch a stream. Could hurt. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. And thank you for the seven months, dude. Okay. So I like Bruno. Uh, 
You know, Di Maria is like an interesting one because he, what was he last year in 86? Di Maria had a really good year. Di Maria had a very good year, guys. So I'm fine with that. This one is... All right, this one's a little confusing, man. Because I don't know like what happened here. I don't really know what happened here, dude. Like, yeah, I don't, I don't know what happened to this one, dude. Like, this one doesn't really make sense because, like, Sancho definitely didn't slow down this year, man. I watched him play; like, he wasn't slower. So I don't know what to tell you, bros. He wasn't slower though. Um, did he get any? Like, he got a plus three, so he's got to have major upgrades. Yeah, plus one dribbling, plus seven physical. Plus four, plus four passing. Yeah, I don't know, bro. Also, why did he get a weak foot downgrade? I just realized that, guys. Why did Sanjo get a weak foot downgrade? Yeah, no, Immobile is not faster than Sancho, dude. That's like, you don't even have to say that, dude. Shadow and Hunter prices through the roof next year. Brad, good to see you, man. How you doing today, dude? I think they kind of turn him into a cam, but they downgrade the weak foot. Phoenix Rising, thank you for the three months, man. Chat, if, if Sancho had... No offense to Man United fans. Guys, if Sancho went to Man United, what do you think this card would be? I didn't see Laporte tweet about his rating. I'm good, Brad. I'm saying like <laughs> Thiago Silva will finally get back the respect of Premier League, but that is not. But th this that is not respectful. I saw his rating, bro. All right. Sonaldo obviously looks insane. Hi Nick, have a nice stream. Yo, good to see you, man. 86 finishing, 88 shot power, 90 long shots. That's obviously like Son is a sick card. Suarez is done. I mean, like, dude, again, I don't really understand this one because, like, how the fuck does Trent go from an 83 to an 87 but lose pace? Like, what's going on here, EA? What's up, Ben? No, he, I mean, he didn't lose pace, but, like, how does he still have the same? No, he did lose pace. He has less acceleration, dude, and he got a plus four boost. I don't even understand, like, what's happening here, dude. But, uh, all right, so, like, I feel like this is deserved. Maybe, like, 86 for Trent. Like, 85, 86. But 87 is cool. This is not an 87-rated card, though. That's what I don't understand. Like, because, like, what? He has one stat at 87? I'm kind of confused how this is an 87-rated card. But this is sometimes how EA does things, bro. How many stats does he have higher than 87? Like, five? This is not an 87 card, though. You guys get what I'm saying? Kinda? Like, do you guys get what I'm saying? I don't think Trent is overrated. I think Trent is really good. Alright, Griezmann. How bad is Griezmann's card? 4 star, 3 star. Okay, that card is actually not bad still, though. Wow, he's got really good dribbling. No, Griezmann's not bad. Griezmann's not bad. Griezmann has a good card. Still. After that season. Laporte is what? 62? No, that's not very good. Okay, so, guys, in the middle of this year, Firmino got upgraded to 5-star, five 5-star. Five so, like, what happened, bro? Why did they take it away? That's what I That's what I got so confused by this morning, dude. David, thanks for the 8 months of Prime, dude. You guys know what I'm saying? Like, they gave us so many, like, upgrades this year, and now they just took them away from us, bro. Because he got 5-star, five 5-star five this year, no? I've been saying that for, like, 6 months. If I'm not correct here, like, then I'm going to be really mad at myself. Wait, dude, what the fuck? Dude, I swear, like, I swear I'm tripping then. I think I'm on a trip right now, dude. There's no way, dude. Like, I swear I played FIFA with Scream Firmino and he had 5-star, five 5-star. Five are you guys sure that it's only this one? Are you guys, are you guys sure? His update was the skill update. Okay, guys, then, guys, I've been saying that for, like, seven months. That, like, he has 5-star, five 5-star five on FIFA. So, like, I'm probably just an idiot. I'm sorry. That's, like, really... Poor for me, dude. I've been saying that for like months, dude. I've been saying like in almost every video. Like I always do that too. Like I have a couple things that I say that are just not true. And I think like none of you guys actually try to fight me about it. Because you just know that like I'm so invested in that belief. That if you say anything, I'm going to be really mad. 
So, like, you guys just kind of fuck off, which is kind of cool, but, like, then I look like an idiot. Oling, thanks for the resub, bro. Um, anyways, Bernardo Silva, really, really not too usable, I feel like. Okay, like, Robertson, man, like, I don't know about 87, dude. Do you guys agree or disagree with this rating? Because I disagree with this rating. What was Andy Robertson last year, bro? Like, in my opinion, Robertson had a way better year the year before this year. Does that make sense? So what was the year before this year? This was... Look, I'm not a, I'm not a football analyst. I'm, I'm just looking at these cards, and I'm thinking that this is a little overrated. I'm cool with him staying like 85, maybe 86, but 87 is a little extreme for this card. Also, this is not an 87 rated fucking card, EA. There's not even a stat above 83 on the face. I don't understand. What is happening, bro? Can somebody explain this to me? It doesn't just go off one year. Well, Robbo's a great player, but like, yeah, man, I don't really know what's good here. I was, I think, I don't know. He, wow, he has high high though. Did he have high high this year? Oh, he did have high high. Well, that's very good. This is gonna be a good card. Again, I just don't know how he's an 87 because it doesn't have 87 stats. Man, if you look like an idiot, I want to be an idiot. Your knowledge is huge. Nah, I'm, dude, I really am an idiot sometimes. I apologize. Kane, thank you for the resub. I love you. Okay, Fabinho 87. Okay, I thought Fabinho was good this year. What was he last year at 85? So what do you guys think is a fair rating, bro? I think maybe 86. But I thought he was good this year, man. Definitely, like, meshed in and I think came out, like, and played well. So, like, I like it. But he got a plus two and he lost pace. How is that possible? Pace is not everything. In-game dribbling makes them faster. So Sancho's going to be faster than Immobile. I feel like 85, 86 is fair. What do you guys think? Okay, Navas is fair. Busquets is fair. Wow, Busquets has 42 pace, man. What do you guys think about that, man? 42 fucking pace. To be honest, the ratings on some don't matter because they'll be unusable. Oh, Chiellini is... Whoa, Chiellini's actually not have bad, though, still. Oh, 60 acceleration. Yeah, fodder, guys. You think fodder? I can't justify him getting an 86 when Thiago's an 80. Dude, that one's crazy, right? Um, Dude, Muller, I feel like, has just like never been a FIFA player, man. It's a, it's a shame. Um, Vardy got a fat upgrade, dude. Three star, three star is gonna be annoying and high high. Like, really, dude? He has good stats, but like these are horrible, dude. Like three three and high high is horrible for striker. Um, Pogba got a downgrade. I mean, like, this is definitely an interesting one because Pogba was hurt like this whole year. But for him to get a minus two is a little cruel, man, considering like he's one of the best midfielders still. So I don't really agree with this, man. I would say like what is he right now? 86? I would say like 87, maybe if they want to downgrade him, but probably like keep it 88 or 87. I don't know. That's kind of fucked. Pogba's been shit for the last two years. I mean, dude, that, I don't know, bro. I think that's like a little extreme, but he's been hurt a lot, right? But like when you compare it to other players, like, yeah, it doesn't make sense that obviously, where's our guy Tiago? He's like 85. So, Baratti, uh, man, Baratti's really good. PK got a big downgrade. I think this card, this guy is still underrated. Uh, Skater Girl, thank you for the prime sub. I love you. Welcome to the stream. Hey, man, keep up the great content. Much love and hope everything goes well. Yo, Ram, thank you for the resub. Yo, has anybody watched Papu Gomez play, bro? Has anybody watched Papu Gomez play IRL, man? Let me go through and look at players he's better than as 87s. Okay. Man, Papu Gomez is unbelievable, dude. Like, honestly, man, I feel like he's underrated. But 86 is cool. He got a plus one, I think, which is good. By the way, I used this card in the beta, man. He's fucking cracked, bro. This guy in Douglas Costa, man. Straight up, bro. Especially Douglas Costa, man. I swear to God, bro. Crazy, man. I only played like 15 games of the beta, but I had like 45 goals with Douglas Costa. All right, 93 agility, 94 balance. Man, this card is going to be so good. What's his finishing? 80. Nice. Okay, Hendo with a big upgrade. Hendo had a really good year. What do you guys think about this rating, man? This is a plus three. What are we saying about this rating, chat? Pete, thank you for the 13 months, my brother. I feel like maybe 85, 84, 85. I think 85 maybe. Man, Henderson had a great year, no? It's a prem boost though. But I feel like because Henderson's an 86, like it's kind of fucked because we have some players that are rated less than him that I feel like are better players than him. What do you guys think, man? 84, 85? Well, he did finish second in player of the year voting this year, guys. So he had a very good year. That's like, like, I know some of you guys are Liverpool haters, bro. But like, 
you guys have to respect when somebody has a good year, man. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like an upgrade is definitely warranted. It's just whether or not a plus three is warranted. We're trying to keep a non-biased stream today, guys, okay? Take your favorite club, set it aside, okay? And just be a fan of the game. You mean to tell me that Jaden Sancho is as good as Heung-Min Sun? Bro, there's a lot of disagreements today. And for that, I will direct you guys to eahelp.com. You guys can go voice your opinions with eahelp.com, okay? Good luck. Steven, thank you for the tier one sub, bro. Yo, Ty, with the 15 months. Ty, good to see you today, bro. Go talk to EA Help, bro, okay? I'm not here to, like, vent with you, man. We're just talking business today. Nobody's being a Liverpool hater. They're just being reasonable. What? All right, but, dude, for somebody to come in here and say Henderson should be an 80-rated dude, like, that's not reasonable, bro. That's not reasonable, man. That's that's a very, very poor opinion. Jamin, thank you for the five months, dude. Welcome to the stream. Much love, bro. Okay. Love your stream. Yo, from Denmark. What's up, baby? All right, so Carvajal got an upgrade. Huh, I mean, Hummel's like, that's understandable. This is just because he's winding down his career. Man, do you guys think De Gea is still overrated? I, I I don't know, bro. I think De Gea should be like an 83, to be honest. What was De Gea last year, bro? I mean, this guy was like really bad. De Gea should be like an 84, maybe. I mean, this guy like... This guy was like all the way up here, bro. And then he's like, right. I don't know. Like, did this guy make a save this year? Bro, I don't know. De Gea was an 89 last year. All right, so you got a minus three. I'm just kidding. But uh, yeah, I feel like this is deserved. What do you guys think? I feel like 86 is deserved. I was just kind of bantering a little bit there. Pissing off some Man U fans. What do you guys think, man? I think 86 or 87 is fair, man. He had a really bad year. To be honest. That's probably fair, right? Or no? 87 max, United fan. That's kind of what I'm saying. I think 87 is, 87, 86 is fine. Varan man got an upgrade. So here's what I don't understand, right? Okay, Varan has been very good for Madrid over the last couple of years. But I don't know, bro. I feel like Ramos was the one that deserved the upgrade this year. What do you guys think about that? America is gifting a sub. Let's fucking go. Is that two subs, America? Two subs from America today. Let's go, baby. 